Hello everyone, this is Justin with Green Residential. So today in my inspection, I came across a wire or some wires, multiple wires, or as they're properly called conductors that had been spliced together inside a wall. Now there are several things that I'd like to point out to you that make this connection improper. In fact, it's probably, it's dangerous. So first of all, all electrical connections should take place with inside a junction box. So obviously this is not the case. These conductors have been spliced together with no box. Second of all, I know it's, it, it's related, it's not exactly this situation, but if there is a junction box installed here, it should be accessible, it should have a cover, and it should not be drywalled over. That happens sometimes. So that junction box needs to be accessible in case someone needs to troubleshoot the conductors and they'll need access to that. There should be no hidden uh, connections inside walls that are not accessible. Another point that I'd like to point out is, so some of these connections were made using wire nuts, which is good. Some of these other ones appear to be just taped together. Now I might be wrong, but it, that's what it looks like. Now, all wire connections should be done using the proper approved devices, such as wire nuts. I do not believe tape is considered a adequate form of tape alone uh, of connecting two conductors or more, two or more conductors. So this situation lacks the proper connectors. It lacks a junction box. And if they do install this a junction box, it needs to be accessible for further troubleshooting. I hope this was informative. If you found it helpful, it'd be much appreciated if you hit that thumbs up button. We put out videos like this on a regular basis and many times they include simple repairs that many homeowners can do themselves. Well, have a great day and bye for now.